Hi, good afternoon guys. So we're gonna start uh, doing a drawing. So I'm going to show you the uh, step by step. So our topic for today is doing poster. So a COVID-19 poster awareness. So we're gonna draw four things, right? Four things. Right? So four things that uh, you need to draw is uh, pictures of hand washing, picture of a house, pictures of food, and a picture of uh, people doing exercise, all right, workout, right? like jogging and uh, star job and so on. All right, so the first we're going to draw a picture of a hand and a soap, meaning that we are washing our hands regularly. So first, we're going to start by drawing drawing a hand. All right, so this today you can practice. If you have an iPad and a pen, you can use your iPad and a pen. If you don't have, don't worry, you can use. Uh, pencil on paper and marker or you have colors you can draw on your paper all right no need to worry so don't you don't have ipad you can draw traditionally okay let's start so first we're going to draw our thumb first all right so this starts so first you draw like this simple like that okay then you're going to draw the first finger Mm, done. I'm gonna draw another line here, and you're gonna draw this third finger a bit longer. Second line, then next, continue from there. Another finger again, like that a bit smaller. And yeah, pinky is a bit smaller, right? Now from there you continue until here then you curve a bit then you go down straight okay now from your thumb before you draw a bit like this a bit curved and not at the end you just take it a bit straight and draw a half a small line here to show our mid here and don't forget the inside we have this this curve and this line yeah, so you're going to draw a curve here and a straight line there. Okay, how about it looks still not, not complete, right? So you have to draw small lines here, right? At the joint. So you draw how many we have here? One, two. So one, two. One, two. One, two. And another one, two. Here also have, right? One. Oh, this one, you have one. So you have to draw like that. So then you draw a hand. Okay, now move to... And move it a bit and make it a bit smaller so you can okay so then you can draw the soap so how to draw soap so last time we had uh, draw a lot of shapes so some soap it depends any soap that you like so it may be any pattern that you like so uh, the soap I usually have is square uh, a rectangle so it's not sharp okay it's not that sharp so it's a bit curved at the end make sure it's curved all right and a bit curved here and curve here then you get yourself shape of a soap you can write in the middle so make a bit line here usually had the soap have a bit pattern so how to show you're washing your hand so when you wash your hand you have bubbles okay now you can draw bubbles so bubble how what is the shape of the bubble so bubble you, you draw a lot of small circle and you mark a bit like that a big one put a small square eh? small square draw a lot of bubbles right and draw on the hand you have bubbles on the hand small circle so it's talking about washing your hand you're done All right next you can color it so since you're finished with the uh, drawing can color it. I'm just gonna close these shapes first because when I color, I need every line to be closed. I don't want an open line. 
Alright, let's start coloring. So, what color is your soap? The base on is any color that you like. Alright, so I'm going for pink. I like pink soap. Alright, so you can color your soap. Oop, oop. Uh, any color. Alright, so. Okay, so can you hit the drawing first? Okay, the next video will show what to draw next. Alright. Alright. Okay. Alright, so. We continue next. After finish drawing the hand, meaning you wash your hands frequently. Next, you're gonna draw a house. Meaning you have to stay at a home, so don't go play outside or go anywhere to keep yourself safe. Alright, so how to draw a house? I think a lot of you know how to draw your own house. But this is the most common drawing. Eh? So we're gonna start doing the roof uh, or the shape of the house first. So we're gonna draw a square. Oops, sorry, wrong color. I'm gonna do black first. We're gonna do a square or a rectangle. And I'm gonna do the rooftop. So most of you always draw the rooftop triangle. So we're gonna do differently. We're gonna do like this uh, a rectangle like here you're gonna do a bit slanting here so it looks like a roof all right so don't forget the door i'm gonna draw the door here don't forget the okay so next you're gonna be drawing the window every house needs a window so how to draw the curtain you just draw a curve like that okay you can add the chimney if you like okay or in the smoke okay so you wash your hands and stay at home okay you can also put like details on the rooftop okay then you can color it so first wash your hands second stay at home next will be uh, exercise so when you are at home so make sure you exercise regularly all right so how to draw exercise so we're gonna draw uh, like uh, gym equipment so we're gonna do a draw a dumb uh, a dumbbell so and other stuff so let's draw things you can do at home exercise like home like and we're going to draw two squares here and you put uh, two lines over there to draw to do like things that you pick up and do exercise you can draw also a ball and draw at the back of your yeah how what is your wall shapes like you can play in front of it uh, at your home so exercise frequently and yeah, so you have mm, okay so you have now finally what to do next next is going to be you have to eat well stay healthy so we're gonna draw like a carrot Uh, some was vegetable that you like maybe uh, mm, a fruit an apple okay and also some mm, white fruit then some bread how to do a bread so mm. So, so now you have all the things you can draw on your posters so make sure uh, then you can draw on top of it your title for your poster and don't forget to write your name at the bottom right so make sure you will need to color everything and submit it in the Google classroom all right Next, I will share you guys the video how to submit your work at Google Classroom. Alright, stay safe.